I4 Technolab Private Limited, an ISO 9001 to 2015 certified and leading sustainable IT service provider. Presence Tutorial of Smart Contract Using Solidity. The purpose of this course is to give you complete understanding and hands of experience with smart contracting using Solidity for blockchain technology. In example 1, we will cover the bidding auction using a Solidity smart contract. It's a smart contract using parity. We start with the Develop tab. In Contract Integrated Solidity Development Environment. Let's start with the practice of smart contracts. First of all, we start our code by declaring the pragma keyword with its version. We already learn about pragma keyword in an earlier video. Earlier video. A keyword. Now we'll start writing a contract name in our case bidding contract with using the contract keyword. Struct with name bid with member user and bid amounts. Bid array for storing the history of a bid. Bid. In the contract with a bid for zero from hexadecimal O using public constructor inside, we push that value to bid array which we have created. Create But it will create a function with the name submit bid which will have parameter bid price with scope public. Inside it we will calculate the last index. Next line we will ensure this bid is more than the current highest bid, the latest bid, by adding require. If it's greater than bid price then we will push the bid with sender address and bid price. price. Why create a function for getting the top bid? For that we create a function with name get top bid which returns with parameter address and uint with public scope. Inside the function, we will first get the last index from the all bids array then we will return the user and bid amount of user by passing the index which we have got. got.
and the creator get a function that will return the total number of bids. So let's create the function with name get number of bids with a public scope that will have a return a UINT. create a getter function that will return a single bid from the array by passing the index number. So let's create a function with the name get bid with parameter index which will return the address of the user and bid amount. Completed the code. Let's compile it. Make sure that the Solidity version is the same as the version we have written at the top of the contract. Act. Steps. Parity Ethereum provides us with the JSON interface, ABI, bytecode, metadata, and the swarm hash. Hash. Finally, want to deploy our contract? Click the deploy button. You have to enter the password to deploy. Successfully deployed, you will see that the transaction mined. Secure contract by pressing the button to execute, which will display all your functions which you want to execute. Execute. When you execute a contract, you will see the method name submit bid with parameter bid price. Let's enter the bid price and select the account from which we want to bid. Press the post transaction button. You can also query for getting the details by passing the index. And get contract. In our case, select the bidding contract. When you click on the bidding contract you will see the queries with the get number of bids. That's it get in bid. this video. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for our next video.